I want to talk about how all of my chat, at least, I, you know what? <laughs> I mean, at least all the males in my chat are something new that I've discovered today. At first, I thought you guys were all virgins, virgin losers. But instead, I found out you're actually badass Sigma males. Now, you might be thinking, well, all right, so I... I know the pyramid here, right? There's the alpha and there's the betas and what are the other ones? And where's Sigma on that thing? Well, let me tell you, Sigma is outside the pyramid. The Sigma and the alpha are equal, but the Sigma male sits outside of the hierarchy by his own choice. That's badass of you guys. I don't need this group dynamic. Fuck that, I'm out the system, but also, I am still in the system equal in hierarchy to the top one. Just to be clear, I don't care about these rankings, but if I did, I would be at the top tied. <laughs> and that's badass, dude. Do Sigma males need women? We'll never know because they'll never come into contact, okay? Because Sigma male's too cool for all that shit. All right, we're going to find out the 10 Sigma male traits. Chat, now if you're not a Sigma male like all of my chatters are, they'll help you out, okay? I swear frats get more and more confusing every year. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, YouTube. They will tell anyone what makes them feel good. And I like that about YouTube. It's definitely not harming our society in any way. Simply put, a Sigma male is an introverted alpha male who lives his life his oh. own way. He basically sets the standard for his life without thinking about what the world thinks. <laughs> he has many characteristics of both types of male person. Damn, Sigmas! I didn't know you were fucking, you got it like that! Holy shit! That is the lone wolf. Damn, there is nothing more lone wolf than a fucking breaking news. I don't care minions meme. God damn. What's funny is, you know, this has opened me up to a lot of new stuff. I didn't know that my uh, grandmother on Facebook was also a Sigma male. <laughs> apparently, apparently she's like the fucking top of the pyramid, dude. She is fucking Sigma as hell. <laughs> But later on, as she crushes his walls brick by brick, and as she keeps on getting to know him better, she'll see that the Sigma male is a galactic space of intrigues that are waiting to be traveled. Sigma male. This is almost predatory, dude. I feel like this is almost predatory. Like, for someone who's like lonely and like no one understands me, and like, you know, it's tough. Because, you know what? And this is true for both sides. This is true for women and men. Or, or yeah, I mean, it's it's hard to talk to the opposite sex or the same sex. Whatever. People you're interested, in, people you're attracted to, it's it's hard. It's scary. And so if like you you're nervous and you know you want someone else to make the first move, a, a philosophy that tells you that you're a f giga chad <laughs> be, because you don't make the first move, <laughs> it's very funny. <laughs> he wants a lady who knows what she wants, a lady who <laughs> values true love and won't find commitment. Sorry. I'm sorry. Wait. I need. I'm not prepped for this. Wait. I'm sorry. I have to be prepped for this. Babe. Harry. You know where my fedora is? All right. Sorry. I just. Sorry. I just. I had to get ready. <laughs> Sorry, I just, uh, I mean, I, I feel like I could absorb more of the knowledge. I don't really care what you think, but it'd be nice to know. Like, if you guys think it looks good, tell me, but I don't care, obviously. Independence. As a girl, if you think that he cares about your opinion or he needed you in his life, you might be monumentally wrong. <laughs> the Sigma male is so dominant that he refuses to be influenced by anyone or anything. Damn. He often does things. Damn, I didn't know Saikuno was a Sigma male too, dude. Fuck, everyone's Sigma but me? Is everyone on Twitch a Sigma male but me? I'm trying to fucking... Ah, I feel like I'm left out of the loop. Oh, man. I'm making all these mistakes I'm noticing. Like, when, like when Arya, like, has a... Like, she's sad about something and she, like, wants me to, like, talk to her about it. It's like, I do it. <laughs> what? <laughs> what the fuck am I doing? I should, I should tell her how independent I am. 
but the difference between them and everyone else is they often learn from their failures and they don't have a habit of repeating them over again. Number three, science. This literally is astrology, dude. This is astrology for dudes. <laughs> that, that, that is something people say, every person would say about themselves. Everybody says this. <laughs> Notwithstanding, if this guy begins to address you or start to talk about something, prepare to be <laughs> impressed and flattered. Be mindful of the fact that everything a Sigma male tells you to have a deeper meaning and is not without a reason. Yeah. As a girl, you should take his words seriously because he never opens his mouth just for the sake of doing it. Fuck he will take no, his dude. Fuck no. If he opens his mouth to tell you about his fucking... <laughs> His top five anime intros? Dude, he's telling you fucking real shit. All right, this is well thought out shit. Uh -oh. Even though some might think that a man like him has no close friends, the truth is actually different. He likes to social- That's so sad. This is sad. This is, that's a heartbreaker, dude. That's so sad. Ah, I feel bad. A Sigma man respects privacy more than anything, and he always needs some time away from a noise. Mom, shut the door! Mom, you don't know what I'm doing here. Shut, shut the door! <laughs> Knock, bitch! <laughs> I need my privacy. Charisma is, without a doubt, one of the most appealing Sigma male personality <laughs> traits. This feature is not natural for a Sigma, but with time, his hind. Wait, can I? Can I still be a, like I? I'm not gonna have all these traits. Charisma is a hard one. That feels like an alpha thing. Do you think maybe I could get in if I don't? Do chat? Would you allow me to get in if I don't have charisma? <laughs> can I be like seventh eighth of a Sigma? <laughs> No, it's a Sigma thing. Okay. All right. Sorry. Sorry for even asking. Sorry. Instead, it is the girls that do the chasing in most cases. <laughs> and they are chasing. I mean, somehow they can't seem to catch me or any of my chat. They're chasing them, though. They're just so bad at, at, at finding them. They're constantly chasing, but it just seems like they never seem to catch up. <laughs> so weird. There's a book called The Sigma Male. And I, of course I bought, you know, four or five copies for me and my friends, but they, well, once I get them, if I need them, which I don't, in fact, I'm going to get rid of those four copies because I realized friendship is the first step towards beta. So I'm learning a lot today. Today's it's unlocking a lot for me. It's sad that people actually believe this stuff. Yeah. I mean, of course it is. It's, I mean, <laughs> I don't think I ever got as bad as someone who would fall for this video, but when I was like, I had, I had seventh, eighth, ninth and 10th grade in different schools because we moved from military. And so like, I was always the new kid and it's tough. And like, if you're trying to fit in, I was so worried about seeming like a nerd, even though I loved video games, I told nobody, like I moved, I, I was, it was like a resolution. I was like, I'm going to move to Virginia. I'm not going to tell a single person here that I like games. I'm going to keep it a dead secret. I dyed my hair blonde, like Eminem because <laughs> that was, you know, <laughs> so I had blonde m, m hair. I would go to school. I would pretend to be into all these things I'm not into. And then when I was at home, when people weren't around, I would secretly play games. I would never play games with anybody else. I never, I was told, I pretend, if anyone asked me at school, I was like, I don't even know. I never even heard of the GameCube, dude. What the fuck is that? What the fuck are you talking about? You were so cool. Holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, that's the thing is I don't, I'm not sure that I was. I'm not sure that I was, but if if YouTube had been a bigger thing, then, you know, theoretically I could have been like, at least attracted to the idea that, oh, you know, you're not awkward. It's just like, you're a, you're a unique person. People need to understand Like that, that I'm sure that kind of rhetoric would be appealing. The problem with YouTube is that no matter what your belief system is, because there's money in someone affirming it, there will always be a video telling you you're right. Someone is gonna tell you you're perfect and right because there's money in it. So it's a, it's a, tough, it's a tough game. It's a burden having to carry the world on your shoulders yet a blessing at the same time. Helping those that you don't even know, compassion beyond measure. Jesus was alpha and omega, but God, God is a sigma while Atriarch is a sigma. <laughs>
Damn, what a burden I have to bear, dude, to be a Sugma. I'm gonna get so much terrible YouTube algorithm now. <laughs> it's already mixing in all of the f If I click this, I'm done. Oh, I shouldn't click it. Five habits of a Sigma male. Stay tuned. The official red pill channel. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, I'm a little worried here, actually. I'm a little worried here just because the internet, I don't care if you go incognito or not, it, it sticks to you. That even when it comes to a vacation, a vacation is not a vacation to us. It's an experience. It's knowledge that we're supposed to gain. <laughs> I had to write this down. I'm about to go on vacation, and whenever uh, Ari asks me to snorkel, I need to be like, a vacation's not a vacation, babe. It's an experience. I'm here to gain knowledge, okay? I'll be in the hotel on my laptop. I'll be reading. I'll be gaining mind share, mind power, okay? You enjoy the hot tub, okay? You enjoy Instagram, okay? I'll be on Reddit. In fact, I, this is crazy, but I may uninvite her. Is that crazy? Chat, you tell me. I'm still learning this. Should I, should I, and we've been dating for years, but should I uninvite her from this vacation and go alone? Yeah. Yeah, I'll go alone. That's red pill. Okay, great. I'm learning. Thank God. Thank God I have my chat, dude. I'd be so lost. If it, let's say this. Let's say you're a regular guy and you go to the Middle East. All right, a Sigma male may dress up in a schmog. It may dress up and put on a scarf. Let's say it goes into Britain. It may dress a certain way. Let's say it goes into Canada. Canada got a style. They may, he may <laughs> dress that way. A what is specific? <laughs> Where, is, where are you going with this? <laughs> That's such a weird. <laughs> uh, two parts of that are so funny. One is how like weirdly specific it is. <laughs> like you got to be a certain type of male to dress for <laughs> the location you're going. And then secondly, how worldly he is. Because he knows so much about the rest of the world. And I like that. Okay, he knew that in Canada you dress some type of way, and in London you also dress some, you know, whatever type of way. Same. <laughs> and if the Joker happens to be a bit on the sadistic side, he finds that woman who is completely upset because she lost her, in her perception, very important team lead position in her company, quite humorous. <laughs> Not because the sole fact that she's. <laughs> Cheryl, you didn't get the manager position. That's why I dressed up head to toe like a clown. <laughs> oh, aren't you the fool? These jokers are Sigma males. Wow. Thank you for watching. That is fucking awesome. I personally think I've learned so much today. Don't think I can really fit any more Sigma male knowledge in, but I'm so glad we unlocked the secrets. Chat, you have to teach me more.